Hey everyone, uh, today's quick tip is going to be how to attach a Google form to an assignment, which um, I have to apologize in advance. I think it's getting a little bit ahead. I probably should have been you know, sequencing these a little bit better, but I got so many questions about Google Forms today that I wanted to make sure those who were ready for it had their answer. So you know you can attach anything from your Google Drive except for Google Forms. Those get attached in a slightly different way. So I wanted to show you how to do that. The first step would be to go to the form that you're actually trying to attach. Once you have the form open, you're going to tap send and choose this icon in the center here. It looks like a, a link. And that provides the link to this Google form. Okay, so instead of actually grabbing Google Forms from your drive, you're going to copy this link just this way. Now I can go back to Schoology, tap my course, add materials, and instead of choosing add assignment where you have the option of adding something from your drive, I'm going to choose two links below that, add file link external tool. And the one in the center is a hyperlink just like the one we just clicked on to copy. And I'm going to tap in this box here and do Control-V to paste that link that we just grabbed and give it a title. And click Add. So now the students have the link to the Google Form. The difference is that Schoology will not grade it. Google Forms will continue to grade it just as it always has done. So if you wanted to add the grade that the child got, you'd have to do that manually inside Schoology and or PowerSchool, wherever you're comfortable doing your grades at the moment. I hope that was helpful in explaining that attaching a Google form to an assignment is a bit different than attaching any other Google document.